Hi Tally Hoes, welcome back to my YouTube channel, or if you're new, hello, hi, welcome. My name is Tally Sharp and it would mean the absolute world to me if you could hit that subscribe button and become part of my Tally Ho community. So as you can tell by the title, today I have the biggest Fashion Over Curve try on haul literally that I've ever done on my channel and I'm so excited to show you what I've got. I've got everything from like loungewear to going out, casual, I've got a lot of jewellery, I've got some shoes, I've literally got everything for you. So don't forget to give me a thumbs up if you enjoy my Fashion Over videos. Thank you to Fashion Over for working with me on this video. Subscribe if you haven't done already and let's get straight in to this video. So. Um, I've got hair in my mouth. <laughs> mm. Two hours later. <laughs> okay, so the first thing, literally my office is gonna be an absolute mess when I'm finished with this haul. But the first thing I got is this Cuddle Time Cozy Pants Set in a 2XL. It is in a beautiful mauve. I can't really say that, to be honest, in that color. It's gorgeous. Obviously, if you're in the UK, then we are currently in lockdown. So I think that this would be absolutely perfect. It is so soft and it's definitely gonna be warm and cozy. It says high quality faux fur on here, which is nice. You've also got pockets as well. Bang in, thank you Fashion Over. I'm absolutely gonna be living in this set. Trust me. I'm not showing you guys anything in any particular order, by the way. At the moment, I think caps are really in fashion. And I think I'm trying to, you know, step up my game. So I got this little, wait, I did it too tight. I got this cap. I don't know. I feel like I'm not really someone that suits hats or maybe I'm just not used to it. But this is quite cute. I don't know. Maybe with my hair like this. This one is, mm, hasn't got a name on it. It is the No Cap basketball cap. I'm basically thinking this kind of cap with like a black hoodie with some cycle shorts and some boots and then maybe like a faux leather jacket on top which I did get in this haul so I'll definitely show you that. Hopefully it fits me right because I feel like leather jackets they don't quite fit me right but I think I sized down so we'll see. I'm super excited to see but yeah do you know what? I'm not completely mad at how it fits me so we'll see. You may be seeing this on the gram. Oh, I can see the leather jacket. I can see that, should we? We should. So this is the vegan leather jacket in black and I got it in a 2XL. For some reason, I thought I sized down, but obviously not. Normally I try things on, you know, after I film this intro, but you know, I haven't got that much patience in this life. So <laughs> I am not mad at how this fits and that the quality is so nice oh my god do you know what it's actually kind of like a nice length it's not cropped but it's not super long line it kind of just hits my hips which i kind of like so imagine like a gray hoodie with that kind of cap or like a lounge set like a matching white lounge set i did try and get that in this haul but when my items were processed the joggers were out of stock so i did get a white hoodie which i'll show you and they do have matching joggers, which I'm trying to get my hands on. So preferably don't buy them yet, guys. Thank you. <laughs> but I love the way this fits and the quality is nice. Yay. I've been looking for a jacket like that that sits right on me for the longest time. Like I can't even, like years. Literally since I was probably 17. And then I got one from Primark, I remember. And within like two months, it was too small for me. And I literally think I wore it once. Ooh, moving on. See, this is something that I'd wear underneath that, but it hasn't got a hood, so maybe not. So next we have the Nova Lounging two-piece ribbed jogger and zip-up set in the color rose, and I got this in a 2XL. Like it says in the name, it is ribbed, and they are super stretchy. Oh my goodness, absolutely love this. The bottom of the joggers are cuffed, which I absolutely love. Just a super comfy, but not too hot lounge set, which I love. The color is banging. The long sleeve top is cropped and it has got a zip all the way up. It's also a mock neck, which is kind of like my favorite type of neck because it's not like completely turtleneck, not suffocating or anything, but it does give you a bit of warmth. So love that. Obviously you guys know that I loved ribbed as well. And it's stretchy. 
Okay, so next I got some lingerie. I might have to get a little Instagram picky in this, you know, because ooh, it is to die for, my God. So this is the Hotel Suite Lace Garter three piece set. And I got this in a three slash four X. Reason being is because my boobs are huge. I don't know if I'm gonna try this on camera for you guys, but I'll show you it now. This is the top. Oh my God. You'll definitely see this on the gram and I can put on like nipple covers and stuff, but I just don't wanna get like demonetized on YouTube for showing you something like this, to be honest. Okay, so this is what it looks like. Absolutely gorgeous. As you can see, it's lace. I love anything that like comes up like this, like fray hemmed kind of. And then the straps are super sexy, a little bit bondagey, you know, bit naughty. It has got an underwire and I think that that's gonna fit my boob pretty nicely, not gonna lie. So I think I definitely got the right size in this. And then we have, don't know what this is called, you know, not fully experienced in the whole um, sexiness. I just sort of like fake it till I make it. <laughs> but this is obviously something that you put around your like lower part, your waist um, and then tie it to some like stockings and then you have a thong is it yeah cheeky and of course the color got me and the lace i absolutely love that so this is super sexy i always size up when i'm getting anything with like the underwire at fashion over just because i do have very large breast assists i'm a size 42 f so i want to make sure that it fully cups my breasts and then I can adjust the straps and make them look super perky. Okay, this is beautiful. This might actually be like my favorite haul ever. Oh my God, wow. <sighs> wow, the quality of this is insane. Okay, so next I got the Italian Romance corset top in white and it's a 2XL. I was kind of umming and ahhing if I should size up. I probably should have just because this has got underwire. I kind of don't really know why I didn't, to be honest. But look how gorgeous this corset top is. Absolutely gorgeous. You could pair this with anything, jeans and heels, or like leather pants and like a leather jacket, something like that. Of course, it's like a mesh one arm corset top. Don't know why I didn't size up, to be honest, because of the underwire. But to be honest, I'm gonna make it work. Why? Because this top is absolutely banging. It does have a zip up at the back as well. I genuinely think we might be here all day. So next I got the Future Shoulder Pad Jumpsuit. I got it in a black and I got it in a 1XL. The reason I got this in a 1XL is because it's got shoulder pads and I didn't want it to look flimsy on me. I wanted it to look really tailored so that I can wear it with heels and a cute bag for like a night out. That was kind of my thought process. I'm hoping that it's gonna fit because I did get it in a 1XL, but it looks absolutely fine. It's got a tie up waist. It's got the shoulder pads, it's got pockets, and then the legs are this really weird, like in-trend fashion over style pants at the moment. Something definitely a little bit different with some black heels would just look like such a vibe with a blazer on top or something like that with some layer necklaces just really like bougie it up. I think it's gonna be comfortable. It's not overly stretchy, but let's see how the 1X fits on me. So your girl did not need any more jeans, but you know me, thought I'd get some anyway. <laughs> it's literally getting dark outside and it's like 1 a.m. 1 a.m.? 1 p.m. So these are the I got it from my mama distressed jeans and I got these in a 2XL. Now they're slightly more rigid denim than I would normally get in Fashion Nova. So I'm a little bit worried they're not gonna fit. They're more stretchy on the legs, not so much the waist. Hopefully I can squeeze into them. And I actually would keep them folded up like how they come with heels and like a one shoulder bodysuit, a cute bag is my vibe, little brunch vibes, little blazer going on. Absolutely needed some like new distressed jeans. So hopefully these will be the one, kind of a little bit worried they're not gonna fit, but we'll see. Okie mcdo kee wow, these are really, really nice. So next I got the baby girl sweatpants in the size 2X. As you can see, they say baby girl on the back. When I tell you that these are soft, these are, 
These are nice. <laughs> These are very nice. I'm gonna be wearing these all the time. I think even with like a bodysuit like I'm wearing now would look super cute. And then some white trainers or some slides. What a vibe, yes please. Baby girl, what's your name? Can I talk to you? Let me buy you a drink. So I've got to a box. So let's show you what's inside the box. So these are the Walk It Out Booty. I got these in a black and I got them in a size eight because it's American sizing. So I'm actually a size six. These are pointed, kind of like sock boots. They're very small heel, which I like. And also it's a block heel, which I also like because they're a little bit more comfortable and they're kind of suede as well. So they're kind of like smart, they're like a little bit posh, you know? But you could also make them a bit casual, I guess. But yeah, I like these. This is called the In Your Dreams Cross Body Bag. Comes like this, but when you open it up, okay, so you have to like assemble it yourself. Let's have a go. I'm not kind of good at stuff like this, to be honest. I'm not good at, you know, putting things together. But um, we're gonna give it a go. I don't really know how. I don't, I'm a bit upset they didn't do this for me, to be honest, because I mean, now I need to look at the picture. Right, so what do I do now then? Right, I, I don't know what I'm doing, so I'm gonna insert a picture for you guys to see. So yeah, that bag will pretty much go with anything and everything. I think with like a hoodie casual outfit, but also like a blazer type with heels, it kind of just suits the purpose. It's kind of like quilted as well, so you can for sure dress it up. I don't have enough dresses in my life, and I got one the other day, and I was like, wow, I'm actually like, a little bit in love so i wanted to get another one this is the mesh behavior mini dress i got this in a 3x reason being is because it's ruched as you can see so i kind of wanted it to just like fit really nicely hug my body but also for you to be able to see the ruching now you don't remove these arms so it's kind of got clear arms which i kind of think was like a nice little touch with some black strappy heels, a little black bag, and then like, I'm still trying to find one, <laughs> but kind of a, um, what do you call it? Trench coat, with a trench coat. So next, I went to an event not long ago, and I saw all my plus size gals there, and Maria Lux was wearing this bag. It's kind of like a belt bag, it's kind of weird to explain. I'll insert the picture, but I just think this is really, really good when you're like, you know you're gonna do a big shop, you want your hands free, you wanna go on a little shopping spree. And I was surprised at the event when I tried this on because I was thinking it's definitely not gonna fit me because obviously I'm like a 2X and Maria's pretty small. So I just wanted to see if it fit. So I tried it on and it did and I was super excited about it. So I had to get my hands on it. It's kind of like a bum bag, but it's like a belt bag. It's, it's a belt bag. I just love the idea of having my hands free, to be honest. Next, I got two of the same earrings. Got one in silver and one in gold. Please excuse my nails. <laughs> Disgusting lockdown nails, what can I say? And also I've been opening like black boxes and like packaging so my fingers are a little bit moving on. So these are the going for it hoop earrings in silver and in gold. As you can see, they've got three hoops, which I think is really, really nice. And they're very in style at the moment as well. What I genuinely love about Fashion Over Jewelry is that it's actually really good quality. Like, I don't think I've ever broken a pair of Fashion Over earrings before, whereas other brands, hmm, I literally could take out the packaging and it could already be broken. So, not naming any names. But um, so as hoops are in right now, I also got this pack. There's no name on it. So I will leave it in the description bar in the order that you see it. But this is what they look like. So you've got gold, you've got silver and you've got rose gold as well. You guys know me, bit of a silver girl. So probably only gonna wear the silver and gold ones. But, oh, I also got some rings. So here I got the tea leaf ring set. So just a literal bunch of rings. I'll leave a picture on the screen as well so you can see. I kind of abandoned my hands. Like, I'm not like, I'm kind of like an earrings girl and then like not really a necklace and watches and jewelry on the hands type of girl because I feel like it gets annoying. But you know, when you go out and about, you want to look the part. So you want to stack on some jewelry, look like, you know, the finished product. Um, so that's why I got those. Moving on, I got another pair of jeans, didn't I? So these are kind of, ooh, a very unique type of wash. 
very stretchy we like that so these are the hole on a sec high rise jeans i love the play on words size 18. these are stretchy normally i would probably get a 20 but i was feeling like i was slimmer for a second apparently the pockets are real hopefully these fit they're super nice i think these are a lot more of a casual look probably wouldn't wear these with heels just because of the wash i don't know am i being funny comment down below but definitely white trainers with these jeans and then like just like a white top really casual really simple so moving on to the other box what have we got here oh yeah okay so at the moment i feel like hoodies and then like a nice faux leather jacket on top with like bare legs and big ass fat chunky boots with the hoop earrings is really in right now with kind of like slick hair in a bun so i wanted to get a nice big black hoodie dress now it says badass on the back, which, you know, I don't like to um, brag or anything, but I do think I'm a bit of a badass. So it's called the badass sweatshirt dress and I got it in a 2XL. Genuinely one of the things I was really, really looking forward to. Close your eyes and imagine this guys, that sweatshirt dress with big fat chunky boots. Like I said, with the hoops in, the slick, back hair or oh, actually forget that hair down with the black cap on and the leather jacket if that's not a vibe then i was gonna say we can't be friends but we can be friends because different views and opinions you know this is getting deep but different views and opinions are great and i love to hear yours so comment down below if you like that outfit idea next i got the to the limit cropped jacket camouflage 2xl i was a little bit umming and ahhing about this jacket but then i thought do you know what why not it's got two pockets at the front with zips they are real pockets the zips aren't real just to let you know as you can see it's cropped it's kind of like um a, a stretchy kind of like not good with my fabrics but kind of like elasticated lasting type of jacket kind of like not a swimsuit but you know what i mean i don't know it is zip up and you do have buttons and at the bottom you can adjust it to cinch in your waist or whatever you want to do with it thought that was pretty cool to be honest i need to sneeze i don't have corona don't worry about it sweetheart so i may or may not have got the same crossbody bag but in white. <laughs> I'll leave a picture up here so that you guys can see. Sorry, it's not in white. It's in nude, Tally. I got the Time for a Happy Hour High Waist Trousers in black and in a 2XL. These have a zip up at the back. The legs provide a tiny little bit of stretch, but they are kind of trousers. So the waist doesn't have any give. As you can see on the bottom, there's a slit going up. These type of trousers are super in fashion right now. You can wear this with like a sexy lace bodysuit, which I'll show you in a second, with like a blazer and some heels. Or you could wear this with like fat ass chunky trainers underneath, like Chelsea kind of boots underneath, coming through the slit with a hoodie or cropped jumper or a bodysuit and a jacket whatever you want to do oh that's quite a vibe actually with like a white top with the leather jacket on top with the fat ass chelsea boots that's a vibe i literally love stuff that you can dress up and dress down because those kind of are typically smarter trousers but girl didn't get it for that <laughs> okay so this is the bodysuit that I was talking about. You could totally wear it with those trousers and some heels for a night out, not that we can go out currently. This is a Somebody to Love 2 Lace Teddy in black, and I got this in a 3XL, again, for the underwire. Again, I'm probably not gonna try this on on YouTube, but I'll add in a photo of the model so that you guys can see. It's got adjustable straps, it's got a mesh back, it's got a thong popper body, and yeah, it's super nice obviously for a night out you're gonna have to wear nipple covers these things aren't just for the bedroom guys you've got to step out that comfort zone do you know what i mean so this is the thing that i was whoa super excited about i'm currently like feeling jackets 
getting really really excited about like autumn fashion so this is the deeper love coat i got this in a 1xl because i really really want it to fit nicely and i don't want it to look frumpy you know i hate when coats make me look frumpy i actually need to really sell a bunch of stuff that i don't wear anymore it's just taking up space and i just they just look frumpy on me of course you could wear this jacket on top of that black dress oh my god what a vibe that black dress that i showed you earlier or any dress kind of underneath um wear it with heels wear it with like a skirt a slip up skirt lace body leather pants whatever but also you can wear it really casual with that hoodie dress and some boots again um you could add a belt to make it look super cool there's so much that you can do with fashion it's a joke and I get so frustrated sometimes when I'm like I have all these ideas and I'm filming a YouTube video and then it gets to like me shooting content for Instagram and I have so many ideas I can only pick like a few because otherwise I literally just wouldn't stop but yeah oh my god beautiful look at this handbag oh it's gorgeous wow this is gorgeous look at the inside gorgeous it's like burgundy inside <gasps> And it's like got built oh my god it's got like a built-in purse wow it doesn't say the name of this bag on the bag so i will leave that linked down below and probably pop it on screen now for you guys but it's just this quilted chain strap bag oh my god i'm in love with this bag like inside you've got the middle compartment with zip you've obviously got the purse feature this is gonna become like my everyday, literally. It's absolutely stunning, love this so much. And the quality is just insane, wow. So next I've got the too cozy turtleneck sweater dress in taupe and in a 2XL. So as you can see, it's ribbed, it's a dress, it's got your turtleneck, gonna keep you nice and warm, although it is kind of like a thinner fabric. So maybe you'd wanna wear some cycle shorts underneath um, and then maybe like a body warmer as well, cause I don't think it's gonna keep you all too warm. I know you guys are gonna get bored of me saying this, but like some chunky Chelsea boots with this jacket and also, you know that belt bag, putting that on top to cinch in your waist, what a vibe. With the cycle shorts, by the way, I meant like underneath, not like showing, if that makes sense. So next I got the Keep Me Cozy beanie. I'm not really, like I said, a hats type of girl usually if there wasn't corona going on right now i would be somewhere hot and you'd only be getting summer content still so maybe this is making me step out my comfort zone a little bit but i am going for walks every single day now and i just think to warm up my head a little bit would be super super nice because obviously it's freezing at the moment i love the color of it it's in nude, so it's going to go with literally everything. It's nice and thick, like really nice quality as well. Okay, so here is the white hoodie that I was telling you about. I did want the matching white joggers and then wear the leather biker jacket on top. What a vibe with some trainers or even some boots. Now I'm going to have to wait for the white joggers, but this hoodie is wow. Oh my God, it's really, really stretchy and cozy. It's like thick, like really nice thick material with like fleece inside as well. Oh, okay, yes. So next we have the Shopaholic short sleeve tunic top in orange and I got it in a 2XL. Now the fabric of this is well stretchy. Look at this. I really like this. Now what I was thinking is some black faux pants, which I do think I got a pair of, so we'll see that in a minute, with some chunky trainers. Not the like traditional chunky chain, wow chunky chunky trainers but more like the like nike high tops don't have any been trying to get some for the longest time maybe i'll just wear my nike air force ones um with again the leather biker jacket now that i have that jacket i'm gonna be wearing it with literally everything this is very like square if that makes sense so super oversized it's not giving you much curve uh, it maybe isn't gonna compliment you that much but it's about fashion okay so i'm definitely gonna have to do this in two days 
Oof. Are these it? I think it is. Oh, I'm so excited. Okay, so we got the Bad Girls Club PU Skinny Pants in black and I got it in a 2XL. So as you can see, the front has a zip. So I would unzip them and I would have the trainers coming through. That's exactly what I wanted to do with that orange tunic top. These are absolutely like to die for. They're a little bit thinner than some fabrics. It's kind of more like a wet look as opposed to like PU because you know PU is like hard to put on it's not stretchy anything like that kind of or the ones that I've had anyway whereas these are stretchy wow okay so next we got the vibe with me tie-dye fleece hoodie in a mint slash combo color and I got this in a 2xl this does come with matching joggers but I was kind of just thinking, well, because I thought I was getting the white joggers, I would like pair it with the white joggers and then some like Air Force Ones or something. Love the print of this, it's so nice. It is cropped and it is fleeced as well, so it's gonna be really warm. This actually would be perfect with those smarter trousers that I showed you with the slits at the bottom. This is the Dinner Plans Corset in a 2XL. I don't know why I've been getting 2XLs in these. I think I read a comment that someone didn't have to wear a bra with this because she kept to her size or something, but it's got a zip up back, it's mesh. So I don't know why she's wearing it without a bra because it is mesh, but anywho, it's such good quality. I would have maybe like a black blazer just leaning on the shoulders, not fully on. Um, and then those trousers with some black heels and then maybe like that new quilted bag that I got in this haul. <laughs> I want lockdown to be over so bad. I just wanna wear all of these outfits. I wanna go out, I wanna have brunches. I wanna see my friends. I wanna just live my best life. So last but definitely not least, you know, with the um, orange tunic top that I showed you, with like the PU trousers. I was kind of thinking the same with this t-shirt. This is the Too Many Fuck Boys tunic top. I got it in a black and it's a 2XL. I especially love the colors of this top. I think she's super pretty as well. It's got pink, touches of pink. Again, I'd wear it with leather pants, jeans. I mean, probably not jeans to be honest. I'm thinking like black pants. Um, any of the ones that I've shown you today. And then some Nike Air Force Ones or any kind of trainers with the touch of pink or the blue in it would be really, really cool. <sighs> that was a super long tally hose. I really, really hope that you enjoyed this video. Please don't forget to give me a thumbs up. Please don't. This video shout out is to Claire Johnson. Thank you for recently commenting on my video. If you guys want to be shouted out in my next video, then all you have to do is comment down below and you may be picked. I love you guys so much. Please don't forget to subscribe. I'll see you very soon. Bye, guys.